how to log in or apply for Grubhub. Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'll guide you on how you can apply for a Grubhub account. So make sure to watch the video till the end. In order to apply for a Grubhub account, all you have to do is just go ahead and first of all, launch the Grubhub application over here. So first of all, I want you to go ahead and open the Grubhub app. Now, when you first launch the application, it will ask you for a couple of permissions. So you can just go ahead and connect to those permissions. Now, sometimes the Grubhub application could not be available inside of your region. So in that case, I just recommend you actually download a VPN service. So you can just download a VPN service if Grubhub is really that important to you. So let me also go ahead and do that as well. Once I do that, I'll just go ahead and connect to specific region that I might want to connect to over here once I select a specific region that I want to connect to I can go ahead and then open the Grubhub application and when I open the Grubhub application and then try to sign into my account I'll be successfully sign in over here as you can see so let me just go ahead and do that let me open the Grubhub app again and this time you will most likely be able to sign in so you can just tap the sign in button that you see over here make sure to enter the email address to log into your account so let me also go ahead and do that once I enter the email address I'm going to just tap the continue button that you can see over here and all I need to do is go ahead and make sure to enter the password then once i've entered the password all i need to do is just tap the create your account button and then my grubhub account will be successfully created as you can see here and this is it on how you can go ahead and then actually apply for grubhub accounts hope this video was helpful to you guys and if it did help you then make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you have got any more questions queries or doubts feel free to also leave them down in the comment section thank you very much for watching till the end of this tutorial and see you soon in the next video